Do you remember when I asked you earlier what you would do if you only had 60 minutes left to live? What would you do if you learned that an atomic bomb was going to land on your city in exactly 60 minutes and that you and everyone in the city would be vaporized at that moment? How would you spend your last 60 minutes? Whatever your answer, I can guarantee that you would not want to get back to the office and return a few phone calls. If you only had 60 minutes to live, the only thing that you would think of would be the most important person or persons in your life. You'd be thinking of them with such incredible intensity that nothing else would be important except whether or not you could phone them or physically get to them before the 60 minutes were up. As you go through life, remember that the quality of your family and your relationships, the people that you would want to be with if you only had 60 minutes left on Earth, are more important than everything else. In reality, all of our external accomplishments will eventually be forgotten by everyone. The investment that you make in building high quality in relationships with the most important people in your life will be the true mark of your success as a human being. You develop the values that lead to an extraordinary, happy, exciting, and fulfilling life the very simple way that you learn a subject or that you develop any physical life. First, you decide the value that you wish to internalize and to make a your character. Second, you visualize yourself acting consistently in a life situation. You continually affirm and talk to yourself and others about the importance and the application of this value. Fourth, whenever you are confronted with a situation, you act as if you already had this value. You behave like a man or woman of character, even if you might be tempted to be a boy. Finally, when you come to teach, you have to help especially your children and your staff, on the importance of this value and how they can apply it in their own lives. Through this process of thought, visualization, affirmation, behavior, and teaching, you build the values in your character as very much the way you install a program on your computer. Your question now might be, what are the best values for me to have and hold most dearly? Good question.